out everyone. This Thursday, April 4th, 194 countries are joining Our Lady of Fatima in prayer. We are going to pray the Holy Rosary for the peace of the whole world and for the consecration of the world to the Immaculate Heart of Mary to complete the prophecy of Our Lady. In the end, my Immaculate Heart will triumph. We are uniting with the Church in Fatima for the celebration of the 100th year anniversary of the death of St. Francisco Marta, the Little Shepherd of Fatima. They are inviting all of us to join in this day of prayer. So what does this day consist of? We are united with the Parish of Fatima, with the blessing of the Diocese of Loida Fatima, and we are promoting this hour of prayer. It is therefore one hour of prayer in the Blessed Sacrament, praying the Holy Rosary for a few particular intentions. So what do we need to do? Firstly, complete a very good confession, so we can be prepared to receive all of the graces that will be outpoured on this day for all of humanity. Secondly, we are going to fast. Thursday, April 4th, we will fast for this intention. Thirdly, we will unite ourselves to our parishes, gather with our towns, our parishes, to unite in this day of prayer called Mater Fatima. So let's talk to our pastors and invite them to this one hour of prayer on Thursday from 3 p.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. That's 8 p.m. to 9 p.m. Portugal Time. Please check what time that is for you in your location so we can all be united throughout the whole world in prayer. If for any reason your pastor is unable to help with this intention, let's fill the churches praying the Holy Rosary together with the Blessed Sacrament for these specific intentions. Lastly, we will end the Holy Rosary with the Consecration Prayer to the Immaculate Heart of Mary and the Consecration of Russia to the Most Loving Hearts of Jesus and Mary. So the intentions for the Holy Rosary are the following. The first mystery will pray for the peace of the whole world, for the Holy Pope, and for an end to abortion. The second mystery will pray for the reparation of the offenses against the hearts of Jesus and Mary. And the third mystery will pray for the Holy Souls in Purgatory. In the fourth mystery, that Russia's mistakes do not spread throughout the whole world. And in the fifth mystery, for the conversion of poor sinners. Finally, we will pray the, the consecration of the world to the Immaculate Heart of Mary, as it appears on the website www.materfatima.org. Finally, if for some reason you can't make it to the Blessed Sacrament or make it to a church on Thursday, April 4th at 3 to 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Bonds and Marian Love is going to be transmitting um, directly from the parish at Fatima on www.lassostv.com. Um, this is a marvelous, marvelous initiative. It's such a unique opportunity that we have here. Bonds and Marian Love and so many Marian movements around the world have already joined this initiative and are sharing the beauty of the total consecration to Jesus through Mary so we can all be united in one heart. In reality, this is a beautiful grace from heaven that we are receiving in this moment of so many difficulties. So without any doubt, let's continue to unite to this prayer initiative and share it with everyone. Thank you so much, and may the grace of God be with you. God bless.